Hey folks, it's Mr. Red the Movie Guy. I hope you're enjoying your Sunday on this April 10th, 2016. You know, in my city, which is Toronto, it's a little cold today. But anyway, great day to watch uh, a movie about the snow because that's Canada for us, right? So I have today's recommendation. Eight Below, starring Paul Walker. Awesome guy. Don't know him personally. But I've loved his movies. He's not done anything really bad. Especially doing this movie with Walt Disney. That's pretty cool. Uh, basically, he rides a, a sled with sled dogs. It's a great movie. It's got action. It's got drama. It's got a storyline, which is pretty good. Um, basically, it says here, the Walt Disney Pictures present Eight Below. It's a thrilling tale of a credible friendship between eight amazing dogs, sled dogs, and their guide. Uh, Jerry, which is known as Paul Walker's character. Standing in Australia during the most unforgiving winter of the planet, Jerry's beloved sled dogs must learn to survive together until Jerry, who will stop at nothing to rescue them. Driven by unwavering bonds of friendship, numerous belief in one another, and thou... And th I can't speak today, sorry guys. Um... Uh, Tremendous courage during the uh, dogs make an incredible journey to reunite in the triumphant and inspiring action adventure in the whole family will treasure. So your family will like this, importantly. Um, I've, I've been a fan of Paul Walker since way before. Everybody's seen Fast and the Furious, but way before that. I can't remember the first film I saw him in. I think it was um, Skulls, if I can remember. Anyway, great actor. Great cast for this movie. You also have in this movie Jason Biggs, who plays his friend Cooper, which is pretty cool. Uh, the one guy also is Bruce Greenwood. He's in it, and he's the American geologist that's got to be rescued in this movie too, which is pretty cool. Now, the only thing is, I got this on full screen. I really want this on Blu-ray. If anybody can find it, please put a, a message at the bottom of the screen. Tell me where I can find it. I've looked on Amazon. I've looked on eBay. I can't find this anywhere. I don't know if they make it on Blu-ray yet, but I think they should because why not? Everything's going Blu-ray or 4K HD, something like that these days, right? Or everybody's downloading because a lot of people are actually, to be honest with you, are too cheap to go out and buy an actual movie. They want what they think is quality 1080p. That's my own opinion. They want 1080p quality, so they think by downloading a torrent thumbs up for them they think that's great i like to keep movie productions in the business i like to keep people having their jobs so they can keep making movies i love personally and now i'm ranting off a topic of a disney movie but i'm just saying if we can all just maybe once in a while buy a movie or go to the movies or you know do something besides downloading a torrent I know everybody's like, well, I don't want to pay $20 to go see a movie in the movie theater. I don't want to pay $20 for a Blu-ray. So I'm going to download it. I'll be honest with you guys, as much as you want to believe you are getting a 1080p quality download, you're not. You will never do that because it's usually on a disc. Now, I'm not saying this is 1080p. This is probably some sort of 720 crap. But personally, it's a Disney movie. Again, April O, Paul Walker. What can you say? On a Sunday? Sounds like a good movie. I'm going to be watching it tonight, so I think it's pretty cool. Um, again, I've made now my third video. I'm starting to get a little more comfortable doing this, but I need feedback from the fans to tell me what I can do to improve, and that would be really cool if I had fans first. I don't have any fans yet. I'm making videos, putting them up on YouTube. That's all I'm doing right now. And I will rant and complain and bitch and moan about anything and everything. I collect movies. I collect TV series. I collect collectibles. I collect all sorts of crap. But movies are my forte. I really like movies. Uh, I've been liking movies probably since I was five. Uh, my dad got me into movies. So therefore... I've been a fan of horror films probably five. To be honest with you, I don't prefer anything more satisfying than a good horror film. Uh, nowadays, I've kind of tried to stay away from a lot of new genre of horror because they don't really make horror movies like they used to. 
And if they did, a lot more people would still go to them. Uh, we get remakes, and some of them could be good. A lot of them are really bad, and we all know that. Uh, as going back on my rants and off topic, Disney has come a long way in its lifetime, and we all know that. It's got every production company right in there. I mean, they've got the Avengers now. They're buying up Marvel movies. They're buying up DC. It's all about marketing. It's all about money and how much they can make. But as long as they've always got a good director, a good writer, and a good producer, we're always going to be in good hands with Disney. And we know that. Disney makes a lot of great anime. Disney makes a lot of good movies. I mean... I'm ranting, I know, but that's just how I am. I start with one movie, and I'll just start randomly top it, talking forever. Uh, again, off my rant, Eight Below is my Sunday's choice of pick. I think it's a really good movie. My family will love it. Um, that's if my kids even stay up, which they probably won't, but that's fine. Uh, anyway, have a good Sunday, everybody. I'm sorry for ranting again. Second video of the day. I'm still getting comfortable doing it. Gotta be a little bit more positive with the way I talk. You guys probably think I live in the bush because of all my real tree gear, which is funny because I just wear what I feel is comfortable. Anyway, hope you guys have a good day. Cheers.